Welcome aboard Sailing Catamaran, Harmony. When we bought her nine years ago, she needed to be repowered. Russ and I decided to reduce our fossil fuel consumption and installed an electric propulsion system. We had problems with that system. It was unreliable, frequently breaking down. When the generator failed to work, we had no backup so we didn't have sufficient redundancy. And we had difficulty getting service and parts for our expensive, complex, cutting edge equipment. We were spending many months fixing our boat in not so exotic locations. In May 2006, we had a total meltdown of our system. We had to repower again. We remained committed to the idea of decreasing our carbon footprint. Through research and with the help of a variety of experts, we developed Harmony's electric propulsion system, which Russ is going to tell you about. We wanted a trustworthy and economical electrical propulsion system. We did not want the failure of any component to disable the vessel. Our experience led us to adopting three design principles. First, reliability. We built in a 20% safety factor at each step in the power chain to allow for old equipment, bad fuel, etc. Secondly, redundancy. We were going to have two of each component, as if we had a complete set of spares, as you might expect on a catamaran especially two sources of electricity, two generators, and a comprehensive switching system that allowed us to power either drive motor from either generator and a switching system that would allow us to power either battery charger from either generator. The third principle is common practice. We wanted availability of off-the-shelf components and availability of local service for those components wherever we might be. It seemed to us that standard electrical practice would suffice. We looked to industrial equipment suppliers for equipment that was commonly used in severe environments such as chemical plants, figuring that that equipment would work just fine in a marine environment. We hired a marine electrician who helped us to formulate our questions, to turn our problems into principles, to specify the design parameters, to do the engineering so that we could realize the design, and to choose compatible components. We also had a lot of help from equipment company engineers who were generous with their time and humor. Let's do a walkthrough of Harmony's electric propulsion system and battery charging system. What we now have are two generators with high output alternators sending power to two variable frequency drives. They control the two drive motors that turn the props. The generators also send power to two battery chargers for the two household battery banks. The battery banks are also charged by solar and wind. The batteries provide power to the household distribution panels for lights and cooking. 